let's see here during a wait state during a wait state and when h ready that is h ready is equal to 0 a wait state is inserted and when the transfer type is busy and here the scenario is transfer type in this case transfer type is busy so here the transfer type is busy and we can see the burst h burst is incr4 that is a fixed length burst in case of fixed length burst fixed length burst means the length is fixed that is incr4 incr8 INCR so on wrap 4 this is the, these are also fixed length burst wrap 8 etc whereas INCR is not a fixed length burst if it mention only INCR then it is not a fixed length burst so only in case of fixed length burst during a wait state the burst when the burst is a fixed length burst that is one of these bursts and the transfer type is busy then the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to sequential and if it is changed to sequential then it must keep the transfer type constant until h ready asserts to 1. So the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to sequential. So the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to sequential in in case of fixed length burst. So the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to sequential in case of fixed length burst that is INCR4, INCR8, RAP4, RAP8, INCR16, RAP16, etc. And when the burst, when the transfer type is changed to, and when the transfer type is changed, it must be constant until H steady gets asserted to 1. Here we can see the transfer type is getting changed even though h ready is 0 because it is a fixed length burst it is changing from busy to sequential and it is constant throughout the throughout when h ready is equal to 0 and when h ready is equal to 1 then the transfer type may change from sequential to any other transfer type so that is so th this is a case of busy transfer fixed length burst now during the weighted transfer in case of undefined length. So here the transfer type is busy and the type of burst H burst is undefined that is it is not a fixed length burst. So in this case burst is undefined that is not a fixed length burst and the transfer type is busy then the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to non-sequential here. So in this case the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to non-sequential in the case of weighted in, in weighted states the master is allowed to change the transfer type from busy to non-sequential in case of undefined length bursts. So here we can see when the h ready signal is 0 during the weighted state the transfer type is getting changed from busy to non-sequential and here notice that and here we can see that the h burst is incr that is undefined length burst undefined length burst and the burst is getting changed we are not con uh, we are not talking about burst we are we should consider this transfer type the busy is getting changed to non sequential and it remains constant throughout when h ready is zero when h ready is zero it, it is not allowed to change the transfer type from non sequential to any other transfer type it is only allowed to change the transfer type from busy to non-sequential when the burst is a fixed length burst when and here we can see 
during h ready is equal to 0 it is the burst is changing from undefined length burst to a fixed length burst so it is not allowed to change the transfer type further and when h ready is equal to high we can see the transfer type is getting changed from non sequential non sequential to sequential so these are the three conditions so these are the three conditions in the weighted state so these are the three conditions in the weighted state where a master is allowed to change the transfer type even in the even in the weighted states even in the weighted states so these are the three conditions a where a master can allow where a master is allowed to change the transfer types even in the weighted states so this is all about today's video if you like this video please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel thank you for watching this video